Hey everyone, welcome into this new video. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you really, really quick how we can create an ad account. Really, really simple. And of course, since it's really easy to do this, we're going to have some time, extra time, so we can actually create our first ad with our first uh, profile, our, our first ad account. So let's jump right into it. All right, so first of all, guys, what I'm going to be creating or let's say uh, manage or administrating is my Facebook page. So what I want to do is to sign into my Facebook account as view is really, really normal. So what I want to do is to go into the home section here into the home section. I want to locate the pages, which is in here. I want to choose pages. I want to select my page and I can switch now. So as you can see, I'm going to just jump a little bit back so I can see this button that says switch now. If you don't see this button, you can always go into this page and go into the switch to form your account into the page that you want to manage. Right, so now we want to look for the Meta Business Suit. So here, what I want to do is to see the menu. I can show this menu. This is the Manage page. I want to look for the Professional Tools, which is actually this one, and look for the Meta Business Suit. This would automatically be sending us into the Meta Business Suit. So what I want to do, if you select here, all this option where it says business.facebook.com slash I want to delete everything and I want to hit into settings and I'm going to hit into enter. Let's see if it's going to be helping us to access. So as you can see, we are now in here into the business settings. This is an amazing tool, a really, really amazing tool for all the managers, for all the administrators, for all the company to help you to manage your store, your, your page, your socials, absolutely everything is in here. So as you can see, I do have users people i have partners mt steps and system users so here into the people here is myself and here i do have a page an ad account a catalog and a business asset group so if you want to figure out how to create your ad account just head into the accounts section and go into ad accounts so here what i want to do is to choose the option that says add and i want to use the option that says create a new ad account as you can see this option for me appears as it's not available because I already have an account created. So if I choose this option, I'm going to just need to choose a name for that. And here is an ID. So I can copy that into the clipboard if I wanted to. And it's really, really easy to create an account, an ad account. So now that we have an ad account, let's jump and create our first ad. So you can be saying that this is a really, really complete tutorial for you to start creating ads from your Facebook page. So now that you have your account, I'm gonna click into this account. Here I have connected asset. You don't have to be worrying about this. If you choose add asset, what's gonna happen is that it needs to link into a line of business. So I don't want to focus in here go into the open in ads manager so here is a new section of meta that this is only specifically for creating ads so you don't want to be intimidated by that just hit into the x button x button x button so what i want to do is to go into the create section this is where the fund begins what you want to do first of all is to create or add a payment option in order to start creating your first ad so after that, you're going to be, uh, let's say, charged for your first ad automatically and you don't have to do absolutely anything. If I scroll a little bit down, I can choose my campaign objective. So I can choose awareness, traffic, engagement, leads, and promotions and sales. So if I am an e-commerce store, what I want to do is to find people likely to purchase my product or service, right? So depending on the option that you want to choose, are the tools that appears for your campaign so for example let's say that you want to create an ad for instagram you want to people to enter your account to enter into your into your instagram right so as you can see if i choose the engagement it says good for messenger instagram and whatsapp if i want to choose for, for example here the option it says traffic send people to a destination like your website app or facebook event so this is just for uh, different places a different website custom website uh, select option that says awareness uh, i think that the best option for us for this tutorial is to choose engagement because we want to send people to my instagram account 
So what I want to choose is to go into the name your campaign. So here into your campaign, you don't want to put something like my first uh, campaign or my first ad. No, so select something that includes the objective or the budget optimization of your campaign. For example, let's say for example, I'm gonna choose like awareness, Instagram, and I want to leave it like that. And here into the ad set, I want to choose, um, let's say, audience from the MX Spanish people from 18 to 30 years old. And here, I want to choose this ad that says, for example, first ad number one or ad number one dot two. And here into continue. And the last part here is really, really easy to start creating your own ad. What I want to choose is to if you want to create a template you can do this in my case i just won't do that for for it's going to be creating a manual option so here into the categories you want to leave it like that we are not a credit card offers auto loans or something like employment housing social issues we don't want to use any of that but if you do are categorized into one of these options then go ahead but in my, in my case i'm not so here into the campaign details i want to choose auction the campaign objective is the engagement. So here into the engagement, that means that I want Facebook to find me people that are more likely to send me, to comment me, to like me, to send me DMs, to comment on my, on my stories, to like my stories, to see my reels. I don't want just people to just click into my Instagram and just leave. I want people to create engagement into my Instagram account. So you want to focus into the main objective of your campaign. So Facebook can be helping us to optimize uh, much more faster our money. Then here, if you have uh, like a very limited uh, budget, you can set it in here. So for example, let's say that I want to spend only $50 and nothing more. So after that, just leave it like that. I want to scroll a little bit down. As you can see, I do have here something that is actually, it says that I need at least $100 for this currency. So I'm gonna hit $100. So this won't be a bother. So here you have, I'm gonna leave it like that, like that. And I want to go into next. And here into next, you can choose the conversion. So here into the conversion, what I want to choose is the option that says messaging apps. Get people to engage with your brand on Messenger, WhatsApp, or Instagram. So here I want to choose into the collected message or a sponsored message if you want people to actually send you a message. If not, choose the option and that might be fitting for you, for example, the website or the application. In my case, I don't want to choose the application. Here's my daily budget. The start today, that's totally up to you. I'm not going to be focusing in here. Of course, the audience, the audience is like the most important part here. So what I want to do, if you remember our custom audience, I want to look for people. I'm going to cut into from Mexico, only from Mexico. And here into the age, remember that I chose from the 18 to 30 years old. So I want to choose this option. I want to choose all the genres. And here into the languages, I want people to speak only Spanish because my ad it's in Spanish. I want to choose Spanish all. There we go. I want to say if you want to save this audience for later, you can choose that. Here into the placement, I can recommend you to select manual placement if you are gonna be really really specific on what you're looking for. For example, in this example, I want to only select the Instagram platform and I want not to use feeds but only stories and reels. We have more options here. I want to leave it everything like that. And lastly in here, you just need to impose your ad setup. In here, your media, your primary text, your headline, the description, the call to action, your website, of course, here you want to include, input your Instagram, sorry. And there you go. Go into the publish section and then into the power is going to be asking you to make the payment information and you can see that your ad is going to be in the draft section so they can be helping you to uh, just review your ad so it can be started uh, within the first 24 hours after the review so there you have it guys hopefully this was a very useful useful video for you take advantage of this great great tool from the meta business settings you can check everything that can be helping us for improving our website our company everything everything it's in here
Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel if you want to see more stuff about the meta business. Uh, suit account from Facebook. Thank you so much again for watching this video and I will see you guys on the next one. See you soon.